Do you want to play the Orinoco Gold Game? So let's go! Whoever collects the most gold coins from the shore of the Orinoco River wins the game. Assemble the game board and place the tree trunks in any order at the source of the river. Shuffle the gold coins and place them on the temple wall. Every second coin stays face down. Each player receives two adventurers in their matching off-road vehicle. Place the adventurers along the jungle shore and then place the off-road vehicle in front of you. Play occurs in a clockwise direction. Ask the players, who has recently searched for gold? This player begins first. Roll both dice. Move your adventurer according to the white die. Use the numbers on the brown die to move the tree trunks. You can choose if you want to move your adventurer or a tree trunk first. The number of dots on the die tells you how many squares to move. You have to push one tree trunk downstream. Adjacent tree trunks have to coincide at least for the length of one square. Not like that! The number of dots indicates how many squares you move your adventure. You are free to move either of your adventures. An adventurer can only move horizontally or vertically across the tree trunks. Occupied squares are jumped over horizontally or vertically and are not counted. An adventurer may only set foot on the temple shore if there is a gold coin resting where the adventurer would land. If this is the case, any extra dots are not used. If you reach a square with a gold coin, you receive the coin and your adventurer returns once again back to the jungle shore. The game ends when no more coins can be reached on the opposite ah. shore. Add up the value of your coins. The player with the most gold coins wins the game. Orinoco Gold is a game for two to four players, ages seven and older, and it lasts approximately 15 to 20 minutes.